I was very fortunate to be born in the United States, born in the Bronx, probably no more than a half a mile from Fordham on 174th and Bathgate. I graduated in 1965. What underscores our country is meritocracy, the rule of law, and the free market system. And one of the underpinnings of meritocracy is education. And one of the things I want to do is continue this process of meritocracy, and that's why I'm here talking to you today. Education, education is the great leveler. And for us to have Fordham at the forefront of this requires faculty, requires facilities, financing, fabulous students, a uh, intense competitive environment and a focus on those drivers that allow us to have the best trained individuals to compete globally. It's one student at a time, one person at a time, one teacher. And to the faculty that's here today, I will tell you your influence continues. I can think of the great professors that I had at Fordham and those that are here today and those that will be here in the future. And we have to, all of us, all of us think about how we can put back into the system what made us the success that we are today, both as a country, as a city, and as a university, as well as individually. Fordham School of Business is 90 years old this year, and having Fordham provide its place of leadership in New York City, and New York City in the United States, and the United States in the world, is very fundamentally important to me. Number one priority today in our country is job creation. And in doing that, education is the important driver. So how can we help? One way I'm helping is to give back to Fordham to help it create the next generation of leaders in our country. It's a fresh start, and I'm delighted to have everyone here today and privileged to be part of this effort. Thank you to Father McShane. Thank you to Donna Rapacholi. And more importantly, thanks for all of you that are participating.